All right, that's what's going on. This is Rossi, and this is Ultimate Team in a Month Part Five. It's been highly requested. A lot of people have wanted to see this, so you know, here it is. I'm gonna be doing these a bit more regular, I think now, since uh, the high demand of wanting to watch them. Yeah, basically. Okay, so this week I'm doing a Mexican squad. So yeah, you probably think, it, well, I don't know. I've never ever played against a Mexican squad. I've never had one. I've never seen any videos of Mexican squads on YouTube at all. So, you know, this is it. This is it, guys. I'm going to show you what I've produced. First things first, I'd like to say I'd appreciate about 200 likes on this video. You know, I love getting likes on my videos and stuff. So, if you want to continue these series and keep building the squads for you and showing you what these beasts can do, then please like the video and stuff. Secondly, I've made a second channel. I don't know if any of you saw my video the other day. Probably didn't. I uploaded it at a bad time. I think everyone's still at school and shit like that. So, you know, if if you could go subscribe to it, the annotation will be in the top right hand corner now. No, top left hand corner, sorry. If you could just head over and subscribe now, that'd be brilliant. I'm going to be doing like single clips and stuff like that of FIFA and stuff. And also going to be doing some vlogs and stuff when I get hold of the HD cam that I've ordered. So, and also a set of videos going to be coming. So, yeah, if you guys could head over and subscribe now and then come back and watch this video again. You know, that'd be, that'd be pretty good of you. I'm already at like 400 subs on that channel, so if I get to like 500 or something after this video, that'd be pretty beast. So, head over to that channel, make sure you subscribe. Okay, so as you're looking through some of the players now, the Mexican players, I'm just getting an eye. But I've, I've done a bit of research on that, seeing what players I should get and stuff like that. So, as you guys can see, I'm looking at an Inform Rainer. Well, I was just looking at Inform Rainer, which I do eventually buy. And I've just bid for another bloke. Who is left wing? Well, I can't quite pronounce his name. I'll have a look what his name is now. Um, Guardo, Guard. Uh, yeah, that one. That's his name. Some that. So, him, him. That really famous guy. So, I got him for left wing because he is 86 pace, 80 shot, and 80 dribble, which I think is pretty decent. To be fair, you know, that's a good player. And. I'm going for a right wing now, and I don't know if any of you saw this guy in the World Cup. I think it was the World Cup. I can't quite remember when I first saw him. Um, Giovanni Dos Santos, he is amazing in my eyes. You know, he's, he's four-star skill, and so is the other bloke, the left wing, I think. So, yeah, they're both four-star skills, which is pretty good if for all you skillers out there. So, I'd recommend buying them. He is 87 pace, which is pretty quick, to be fair. 82 shot and 87 dribble and you know that's unreal but I did get the informed version so the normal version will be a little bit less than that but it doesn't really matter because they're still going to be fucking sexy so as you can see I've just sorted out both my wingers and you guys probably thinking already you know who I'm going to get for a striker and you probably do know I'm getting obviously young Hernandez based in Manchester United and you know, he's a must buy I I love him on this game. I had him in form but when I had my Premier League team. But I've sold him. So I've just got the... Well, I haven't even bought him yet. You guys can't even see that I've bought him yet. But I've just got the normal version, the 79 version, with 85 pace, which is beast, and 74 shot and 76 dribble, and 81 header in for a little man, which is quite surprising. But, yeah. As you can see, I'm just about to bid for him now. 1,000 coins. I'm not quite sure. Is that a good price? Let me know in the comment section. 1,000 coins, Fernandez. I'm not... Not really sure, but you know that'd be pretty decent. Oh, it sounds like a good bargain to me. There's also a player I forgot to mention, which I didn't actually buy in this game. Well, in this squad, admittedly, uh, I didn't quite think he was good enough for what I wanted. But there's a bloke called Barrera, plays for West Ham in the Premier League. Well, Premier League was the Premier League, obviously they're good now. He does. He plays for West Ham now. He's four-star skill, and you can actually pick him up for about 300, 400 coins. And, you know, that's a bargain in my eyes for someone who's four-star skill in the Premier League. I don't think there's... Well, there's not many five-star skill skillers in the Premier League. I know that for a fact. There's like Nani, Ben Arthur, um Fuck knows. There might be a couple more. But, um, you know, he's a four-star skill, which is still pretty decent. In this squad, there isn't actually any five-star skill players. But I think there's about uh, four, four four-star skillers. And... Well, well, it's like, well, the top half, okay, so you see the top six. So there's left wing, striker, right wing, and then three centre mids. All of, all of them, I've got, well, Hernandez and, well, I, oh, you haven't even seen it yet. I don't know why I'm saying it, but two of them are three-star skillers, and 
and there's four of them with four star skill which is pretty decent to be fair if you guys want to have some skillful squad I don't think there's any Mexican five star skillers if someone could if someone knows the answer to that then let me know tweet at me my uh, Twitter's in the description I'll definitely reply to your tweets and stuff like that so I'm very active on there so make sure you follow me uh, or comment in the comment section I try and read most of the comments you know I do get well I like to get a lot of comments and I like reading the comments so you know that'd be pretty decent if you could let me know if there is because if there is I've missed out on a play a five star mix skiller which I'm gonna be gutted about because obviously it's all about the skills these you know what they say as you guys can probably see I've just bought Rodriguez now he is a silver I think he's the only s no this I buy two silver players in the squad and he is obviously one of them so he is a three star skiller I think his ratings are 69 pace which is which is poor but for centre mid it's not really neither here or there to be honest it's still pretty good um, we've got a 73 shooting but 74 passing and 71 dribbling which you know for us I really struggled finding three decent centre mids for my um, obviously Mexican squad and that but as you can see I've just bought a guy called Lud Ludina Lud Daniel Ludina who's a CAM so sent attacking mid because I couldn't find a CM version of him but I do actually have a a card lucky enough to make him a centre mid I don't only change the chemistry by about one but oh well every little helps and this guy's a four star skiller I paid nine nine coins for him so he's still pretty decent and stuff like that so I don't think I mentioned about the right mid that I bought a guy called Rainer Angel Rainer. He I bought I paid five five K for him, should I say? Um he's a four star four, oh, he's a four star skiller and obviously eighty two pace, eighty two shot, eighty passing, eighty five dribble, and you know that's pretty tank to be fair, you know. It's gonna be fucking beast in it, I tell you. And now I've gone on to my defence, I've bought Salcedo plays for Fulham, left wing back. 77 pace, 72 passing, 76 dribble, and then 72 defense and 78 header in, which is pretty good for a left back. You know, he's where was it? He played really well in. It might have been the World Cup or against England or something like that. He played really well, so that's how I knew about him before we came to Fulham. And as you're looking at now, I'm buying two centre mids, um, a Rodriguez and Moreno. Now. I struggled getting centre mids, no centre backs, fucking hell, what am I saying? Cent I struggled getting centre backs because I, I generally do not know, I don't think there's very many, but I've got two, they've both got pretty deep, fair, well, pretty decent header in. 79, one's got 79 and one's got 78 and they've both got like 76 pace and 74 pace, I think. So, you know, I think that it's possibly better they do have like... You know, just two villages or something in defence, that'd be pretty decent. But, um, or a Thiago Silva or something, you know. Mexico, you need to get a Thiago Silva quickly. And right back, I've got Mendez. 73 pace. And, well, 66 passing and 66 defence. So, I lacked on the right back scene as well. So, that's pretty poor. And then in goal, you've got Corona. Who I paid 3500 for, which is a fair price for an informed keeper. 81 dive, 80 handling, 84 reflex, is it reflex? And then 85 positioning. So, as you can see, guys, this is my squad. Please like the video, comment, go subscribe to my second channel, follow me on Twitter, please, motherfucker. And yeah, that's about it. Peace out, guys.